Hi everybody, how are you? I hope everybody is fine and welcome again in this new video in which we will see uh, how to deal with some BIOS, BIOS issues uh, when it comes to some Toshiba Satellite Pro. So as you have seen at the beginning of the video, uh, it's usually advisable not to try random dumps in the internet before trying to see if you can fix your views issue with any laptop, not only Toshiba's, with any laptop you have to try first uh, the update files offered by the support of uh, the brand so in this video we'll see some uh, Toshiba Satellite Pro which uh, can be fixed by your full BIOS image when it's obvious issue or full BIOS image which we can extract from uh, executable files uh, offered by Toshiba support of course and uh, for this video we have uh, we have, uh, I think, I have uh, prepared three uh, three files which we will see. I th yes, we have three uh, products here: uh, Pro C40, J10S, Pro C50E and pro c50h so and uh, we have the files which uh, we have downloaded i have downloaded from the toshiba support so it's easy uh, to search for these files you just uh, so let me copy this reference for example you just go to your browser and uh, simply uh, like this BIOS you search for your model exactly like this and you uh, check the Toshiba support of course like for example we have uh, this one here so and you uh, we have this one here as you can see here we have the uh, this tab which gives the information of uh, the laptop but to download the uh, file the executable file you have to go to uh, her support like this and um, so we see it as you can see here we see it c40 uh, g10s so you do like this pro uh, c40 and uh, this is it and go so it's let's check if it's the same one so it's the same one yes and you uh you go to download drivers and there you specify BIOS to limit your search results to uh, BIOS only and you click on download and you download the file to your uh, working PC on which you're uh, going to uh, do the job so as we already have the files here or downloaded let's just see how we can extract these files so if for example we opt for extracting with uh, rar we will get another executable file like this this one and we don't have the option to extract it with with uh, RAR or with WinRAR or uh, even if we use for example uh, Universal Extractor we will get uh, we won't get uh, what we need as you can see here we got all these files extracted from the uh, that file but it's not what we need so let's just control a and let's keep only our original file which is this one and let's delete everything with the keyboard again let's extract here we will get this executable file and from this file we have to extract 
the full BIOS image. Same thing with this one. Extract here, we will get an executable file. And same thing with the third one. Sorry, I have to extract here like this. Same thing, we got this files and if we try to uh, run these files we, we won't go uh, get anything or we will uh, get uh, same the prompt which tells us some information about this uh, one and some codes and how to uh, uh, deal with this executable file let me show you for example we can launch same the here yes and we got it here and uh, we simply uh, copy the name of the file and we go here and with the right click to copy it it's copied twice so let's remove let's remove everything Control v and space slash and let's force it so if we force it like this you we will get this this other uh, window which gives us some information and uh, what it's about it's an um it's an uh, ime uh, uh, bios and uh, there are some commands which we can use with these tools here but this is advanced and you don't need to uh, bother yourself with this you just uh, go to uh, so you have to use the uh, tool which is called i'm me i'm e i'm a UCP. So you can find it in my group of Telegram. Let's open Telegram. I will show you where to find it. Let's reduce this. So uh, when you open your Telegram uh, desktop, of course, you use search for ERA support like this like this let me zoom error support like this you will get a result with this icon here and you uh, get in it and inside this group you search for imi ucp like this and you will get this result you click on it and you will be directed directly to the file to the uh, tool you uh, download it with the right click save as and let's put it in uh, the main folder the main folder which is Toshiba Sat Pro series yes let's put it there let's save okay so we uh, have it on our working folder here it is now let's reduce this telegram we don't need it anymore so as we have our tool here we just extract it here and uh, we got this here and with some uh, photos which uh, uh, help uh, you to find your way with this tool so here is how you open so you go to open and you choose your file and then when uh, you choose your file you just uh, select this extract then you go here you uh, click to highlight the room file and then here you uh, add uh, you make a name to your file which you want uh to give your file as the output and then you hit apply and you will get this uh, message saying action successful so let's do it with our files so we uh, go to the folder which contains the tool and we launch the tool we will get something like this and you hit ok let's uh, minimize and you go to file open and of course you go uh, to the folder which contains the executable file which you have to deal with this for example go here the first one which is 
the C40 G uh, J, sorry, so like this, and we have the room. We have it here. So first of all, we check this box extract. We highlight uh, by selecting uh, the room here, and we give it a name, which is uh, let's use the name of the C40. G. Yes, let's use let's use that C forty and dash G like this. Uh, better to add uh, the extension dot bin, and uh, if you pay attention to her, you will uh, see the file coming after hitting this apply here. So. Let's zoom, apply, we have the file and we have the message saying action successful. Okay, let's close that message and let's open our file. As you can see, we have the header and we have the water. That's fine. We can check the partition of the file and it has the descriptor the bus region and the mirror region okay let's do the same thing for the other one which is this one here let's open it first so it's uh, c50e let's go to file open c50e uh, choose the file here highlight the room so c50 dash e and uh, dot bin extension don't forget it and let's apply and we will get our file again let's open it again header footer everything's fine we can use the files directly let's go to c50h and let's open the executor let's give the tool the executable file of uh, c50h like this extract room give it a name give it for example dump for this one we will use dump dot bin better to use the uh, name of the, of the version of your laptop or give it whatever you you want or you desire the uh, important thing is to get the file so here it is open it and that's really fine and it's a 16 megabyte file for this one it's an 8 megabyte and for this one it's a 16 megabyte so here is how you can uh, extract a full bios image from some executable files for toshiba satellite pro series I said some because some uh, of uh, executable files of Toshiba Satellite Pro series uh, con do contain only the BIOS region and for those this uh, method we have seen in this video won't work uh, you should uh, do it in a different way which we will see in another video until then uh, we will stop here and uh, see you in the next video. Bye-bye.